Sag, hey, Sag, hey, hey, Sag, hey, Sag, hey, 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 hey. Hello, Sagittarius. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys had a good weekend, my loves. And everybody is, you know, safe and and um, especially safe from the lunatics. You know what I'm saying? So, Sagittarius, how are you guys? So let's get started. Let's see what type of lunatic may be coming towards you in this love thing. Keep in mind the situation here could be reversed, vice versa. Um, if you are connected to a Sagittarius, you know, the Sagittarius may have done this to you. Okay, I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> All right, Sagittarius. Let's see what we got. Sagittarius. Sagittarius. What is coming towards Sagittarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus in love. Sag, hey. <laughs> what is coming towards Sagittarius in love? What is coming towards the Sagittarius collective in love spirit? Sagittarius. Sagittarius, in love. Sagittarius. Okay. Sagittarius, express your love. I know it's hard. <laughs> express your love, Sagittarius. And you also have calling in your soulmate. So I feel like Sagittarius, some of you are definitely manifesting and calling in, um, you know, somebody who's definitely your match, right? Energetically, emotionally, spiritually, mentally, you name it. You guys are definitely manifesting that. Okay. Maybe you feel as though you've already met the soulmate or this person feels as though you are their soulmate. But, you know, bottom of the deck, Sagittarius. You have healing family issues. Sagittarius. What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? Oh, oh my God. I'm sorry, guys. Act right. Dang it. All right. <laughs> Sagittarius, what comes towards Sagittarius in love? Sagittarius. Sagittarius in love. Sagittarius in love. Sagittarius. Ooh. Okay, Sagittarius. I'm here for it. You have a lot of cards. All right, so what we're going to do. I like, okay. So let's take Be Gentle and also a Sacred Connection. Mm. So you got a sacred connection going on, Sagittarius, okay? It could be a little dark night of the soul going on. A whole lot of, you know, intimacy, a whole lot of exploring each other. And <laughs> Sagittarius. down for that some of you are connected to a cancer let's pull let's see who you could be dealing with first and foremost sagittarius and stay tuned towards the end where i will be telling you guys um even doing a career and a, and a work reading who is sagittarius who look at my daughter what my daughter did oh my god who is sagittarius dealing with angels who is sagittarius dealing with Ooh, so Sagittarius, you're dealing with somebody with a G in their name. You have an A here. You have a tree of life. There's a lot of horses here, a cat, ooh, bicycle dog, someone who has a dog. Who is Sagittarius dealing with? H, F, J, um, someone who does music, Pisces. I do see an O as well. Um, v. And also a U. Who is Sagittarius dealing with? There's an E here. I don't know if I said that already. A lot of A's and a lot of E's here. Um, Sagittarius. I also see a Z. Okay. So strong A, strong um, E, strong H, I believe. F, J, strong J. All right. Sagittarius. Sagittarius. What is coming for Sagittarius in love? Sagittarius in love. What is coming? Okay. The sun. So Sagittarius, you're definitely dealing with a Leo for some of you. 
What's coming towards Sagittarius in love? What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? What do you have for Sagittarius in love? Mm, four of Wands. What's coming towards Sagittarius in love? Sagittarius. What the freak? Uh, <laughs> you guys got some good shit. What's going on in here? Oh my god. I don't even know how I don't even know how to like interpret this reading any any, you know. I mean, it's very straightforward. So it's either you're dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Very strongly here, Sagittarius. There's a whole lot of chemistry. There's a whole lot of warmth and happiness. Okay, I feel like this is someone you feel like you could spend the rest of your life with. You're very happy about this person. This person feels as though you make them very happy. Um, there's strong feelings here, strong vibes, um, Sagittarius. This, this is someone who has very deep feelings and emotions for you. And it very well may definitely be a mutual. Now, I know some people be like, oh, I don't want the past. Listen, it's a general reading. I'm not sure if this is a past or a new person. Just may, um, you got to make it fit your situation, okay? Some of you, this is a past person who's giving you this commitment, who's giving you this love, who's making you happy. Some of, um, others of you, this is a new person, okay? But bottom line, Sagittarius. I see that somebody may want to get engaged to you. Somebody wants to marry you. Someone's seeing you as marriage material. Um, this is definitely life partner material here. What I'm seeing here, Sagittarius. I feel like you've called that in. You've really called this connection into your life because you've cut out, you know, the player from the Himalayas and the motherfuckers who don't serve you, Sagittarius. So now you're being rewarded with a very pure love. That's what the sun talks about, a very pure and innocent love. Okay, what is coming towards Sagittarius in love? Tell me more about this love situation. Wow, the fool. Some of you are maybe having a brand new start, brand new beginning with someone that you already know. What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? This could be an Aquarius. Wow, Sagittarius. <laughs> Listen, you're get, your wishes are coming true. Your wishes are coming true. Some of you, um, you know, you're being rewarded with this type of love because you got yourself out of a situation that just wasn't, um, that just wasn't, you know, fulfilling you or making you happy. You knew what you deserve and now you just took a, a risk here on this love or someone's taking a risk and a leap of faith on you, Sagittarius. Tell me more. What's coming towards Sagittarius and love? So now spirits like be gentle okay be gentle because you see i feel like sagittarius some of you um i feel like you're used to people kind of saying a bunch of shit but not really following through with it you're used to empty promises you're, you're used to people who just pretty much um bs you all the time okay and you're gonna look at this person this is you or whoever's in this guarded energy someone's guarded you're gonna be looking at this shit like like who the who the who the freak sent your ass? Who are you? Okay. <laughs> this motherfucker ready to take that stick and just knock your ass out, right? Because there's a love offer coming in, Sagittarius. There's someone who wants to make your dreams come true. Somebody who wants to um, fulfill your every desire, Sagittarius. And I'm not just saying that. I mean, this person loves you. They want to move this forward. They want to move, you know, it could be a cancer, but some of you, you can expect to be um, engaged or proposed to out of nowhere, Sagittarius. Yeah, some of you. This is your soulmate, Sagittarius. That's who they are. Um, there's really no need to clarify. <laughs> but maybe Spirit is saying someone really just needs to let their guard down and, and express this love. Don't be afraid. Just, just let it happen, Sagittarius. Just, just. Feel this person's warmth. Feel this person's light. Feel the joy that they're here to bring you. You know, and just just enjoy it. Just bask in all the glory. <laughs> because that's what they want to do. They just want to make you happy. This person wants to make you happy and fucking, you know, live with you, marry you, whatever you want to call it. This is a very good reading. You know? Tell me about this, um, <clears throat> tell me about this fool for Sagittarius in love. The fool. The fool. So, um, someone just needs to take a leap of faith here. So, I feel like someone's saying, okay, I'm ready to take a leap of faith. Are you? Are you? That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm hearing. 
Someone's going to take a leap of faith with you, but they hope that you take a leap of faith with them. This may definitely be somebody who, um, who, who may have had control issues or maybe someone in this situation may have had control issues. Um, and someone may have been a bit impatient in this connection, but it's worth waiting for. Spirit is really emphasizing that someone needs to be more gentle. Um, kind of like, like don't overthink it or someone may have trust issues. You have issues trusting that this person's intentions are pure or that they really love you. They do. They do. Sagittarius. I don't know how else to say it. If this is someone who had pride and ego, they're taking a, a leap of faith here. Knight of Cups for Sagittarius and love. Knight of Cups, please. But some motherfuckers riding up on that horse, Sagittarius. And this is what they want. They want you to make a decision. The lovers could be a Gemini, but they choose you. They want to be with you. Um, <clears throat> you have the Empress could be a Taurus or a Libra, but whoever the hell this person is, you know, they, they, they want to lock it down, Sagittarius. That's what they want to do. If this was a third party in the past, it's not a third party anymore. They're coming to you. They're bringing their cup to you. If you don't want them, that's cool. Nine of Wands for Sagittarius, please. Nine of Wands. But I think your automatic reaction is just to kind of be on the fence and close yourself up. But Spirit is saying don't do that. Yeah, see? Spirit is saying to don't overthink it. Get out of your head. Easier said than done. But that's what the advice is here. Okay, Eight of Wands. This could be someone who's long distance. There's definitely some love arrows that's going to be shot your way in your direction, Sagittarius. So, you know, just, just, I know some of you just, you know, would want to be head over heart, but I feel like this could be a good thing if you take a risk with this person, Sagittarius. Some of you are dealing with an Aquarius because Aquarius had a similar reading last week. So if you're dealing with an Aquarius, maybe this Aquarius is going to get out of their head and um, just take a leap of faith here with you. They will. And they will express their love. They will. <laughs> All right, Sagittarius. So let's see. I mean, like I said, this was a short love reading because there's, I mean, what the freak can I say? You know, this is really lovely. <laughs> this is lovely. You guys have a good reading this week. Um, let's, let's see what work and career has for you. Angels, what does um, work and career have for, what is coming towards Sagittarius and work and career? Work and career for Sagittarius. Work and career for Sagittarius. Work and career for Sagittarius. Okay. So Sagittarius, um, some of you may be having financial difficulty, okay? Or you may have had an issue at work to where you don't feel cared about. You don't, you feel like you're being taken for granted possibly. But I'm seeing you coming out of some kind of difficulty when it comes to your work, your finances, you name it. Um, you're coming out of that difficulty and you're moving into calmer waters, okay? Um, something's being resolved possibly in your favor, okay? What is coming towards Sagittarius in work and career? What is coming towards Sagittarius in work and career? Work and career for Sagittarius. Work and career for Sagittarius. Some of you um, are going back to work. Okay, after taking some time off, or maybe there was an injury on the job, something to where you didn't feel good. Um, maybe you were sick or something. But bottom line, I see you getting back your energy. Nah, Shay, I see you really getting back to um, to work here with the Eight of Pentacles. Some of you, if you're out of a job or something like that, I see a lot of offers coming your way with the Eight of Wands. One of them may require you to travel, possibly. Um, this may be a long distance job or a communications job, like a call center or something like that, sales that may require you to, um, you know, communicate, obviously, or be in a vehicle. But either way, Sagittarius, um, if you're hoping to return back to work, you will return back to work. You will get communication very soon in the next few days or maybe even within the next week so that you can return back to work, Sagittarius, okay? But bottom line, um, you're overcoming whatever difficulty that you're having in your work, okay? In your job search, whatever the case may be, there will be jobs coming towards you and opportunities, Sagittarius. So now, last but not least, <laughs> let's see, Sagittarius, what this person would want to say to you. It's a whole lot of cards. Oh, damn, oh. Oh, give me a second, guys, because I have like a whole lot of cards in here. Give me one. Uno momento. <laughs> All right. All right, here we go. 
here we go you know what flipped over though i just want to make you happy i just want to make you happy flip the freak over angels what does this person want to say to sagittarius wow okay those came out quick you are always on my mind can you forgive me so if you can forgive whoever this person is for some of you, maybe they were making empty promises in the past, but I see that they're definitely very sure and they they really want to pursue this and pursue you and they really want to settle down with you. What does this person want to say to Sagittarius? What do we have for Sagittarius? Messages. <clears throat> Messages for Sagittarius. Someone says, you deserve so much better than me. And maybe this is better. <laughs> Whoever this new person is, is better. What does this person want to say to Sagittarius? I fell really hard for you. What does this person want to say to Sagittarius? What messages? This person makes, feels like you make them so happy. They just can't get enough of your energy. Um, I only feel a sexual attraction. Some of you are healing from somebody who's a damn player and it was only sex with this person. And now you got somebody who wants sex and everything else. <laughs> Sagittarius. <laughs> Someone says they want to start over. Sagittarius. Ooh, you are my person. Sagittarius. So they feel like you're their person, Sagittarius. And this they, they're serious about this. We are soulmates. <laughs> so someone's like, we are soulmates. We are doing this thing, Sagittarius. We're doing it. Anyway, Sagittarius, enjoy. Have fun. Um, you know, keep things lighthearted. Be optimistic with the sun. And just enjoy it. Enjoy it, okay? Love you guys. See you guys next time.